so our next ingredient is going to be this base cream this base lotion right here which is kojic koji don't mind it's within their skin whitening but it is not it doesn't whiten the skin these are the benefits let me just read out some of the benefit of this product it opens the pores it also prevents skin sagginess it also fights skin dryness oh my god and protects the skin from bacteria and some of the health benefits protects skin from toxic buildups due to sun exposure Pro promotes skin elastic like it promotes skin like and also prevents skin break breakage and if you also have stretch marks you can also use this this lotion is very very good the lotion is very very good and you can see here i don't know if you can see this they say it is i like it is ideal or ideal for daily use free hydroquinone like it doesn't contain hydroquinone so you are free to use it so this product right here it, it has a lot of benefits and the next thing i'll be using is vaseline this is the one i'm using cocoa butter vaseline can you see this i've actually been using this for a very long time you can see So I'll be needing this. I'll be needing this Vaseline also. And the next ingredient I'll be using is a spin. This is how it looks like. I've already crushed some of the aspirin. The aspirin that I'll be using. So let me just show you right here. This is the this. I don't know if you can see this well. Oh my God, this lighting. So, okay, can you see this? This is the aspirin. This is TV tablet right here. I wanted to crush all of the remaining four tablets, but I just wanted to show you all how it looks like. So, for make things that if you want to, this is my the best way. Like for me, this works for me very, very, very well. All you need to do if you want to crush this aspirin, just look for a piece of paper like this one. And you can get a bottle, just any bottle, and crush it. Put it on the floor and crush it. So, let me start with this aspin. I'm just going to transfer the aspin right here to this bowl. Can you see that? And I'll just put a drop of water in it. You need to use water to dissolve the aspirin. Use water like this to dissolve it. If you don't dissolve this with water it's going to be like it's not going to look nice into your your ready for mix stretch mark treatment so you need to mix it very well just crush everything we need a smooth paste in here like this is why I'm taking my time in doing this because if you don't crush it very well when you apply it on your skin when you apply your treatment your stretch mark treatment on your skin the aspirin will be very very hard you will be seeing it inside the 
the treatment it will be very very hard so The next thing The next thing I'll be needing now will be my Vaseline This is how it looks like So I'll be needing I'll be needing this like not too much just one spoon of Vaseline will be okay for me this is very 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 sticky I don't know I could have just that I forgot to put it inside that warm water this, this is going to be very, very sticky. So now I'll be needing my shea butter remember i told you all that it was too sticky so i as you can see for yourself now it's no more sticky it has stayed in that water for some time so right now it's much easier for me to use it i could have done the same thing with this fastling just that i forgot so can you see how it looks right now i'm needing that's already one spoon of it i'm just going to use everything every spoon two spoons sorry this is exactly the big spoon this is organic shea butter so don't mind the way it's looking it's very very original Always makes this well. Can you see that? That Vaseline has actually melts like because of the hotness of that shea butter that I just pour in here right now. Can you see? It it has really helped in melting that Vaseline. The Vaseline was so sticky. Thank God, the, the hot shea butter has helped me in melting it. I don't have any shea butter left at home, like everything is finished. So I'll just be making a very small quantity of this treatment. Okay, I think this is, can you see this? The next I'll be needing will be this. Let me show you well. This is how it looks like. Look at it very well. So I'll be needing like five spoon. 
So let's just let's measure everything. Let's do the measurement together. Can you see? It's very, very thick. Very thick. And it, it also smells very good. Oh my God. Uh, this is, I'll just consider this to be two spoon, like everything that will be TV spoon because it's that was huge. It's in four. Five. Six. This is okay. Let's do the mixing right now. This thing you see right here, don't joke with it though. It's very, very, very effective. <laughs> oh God. It is very, very effective. Very, very effective. Okay, so let me just quickly say this. As for the anti uh, green vein treatment, or like if you have almond oil at home, you can add it to your pomix cream. I'm not talking about this one that I'm pomixing right now. This one, the one I'm pomixing right now, is actually meant for the stretch marks alone. So if you have almond oil, or even olive oil but I prefer almond oil but if you don't have almond oil you can use olive oil like organic almond oil or organic olive oil add it into your pomix mix cream or lotion or your lotion just add it into it and if you don't have this ingredient that I just used mostly the especially the base cream that i use in doing this mixture if you don't have it don't worry all you need to do is you can just get your get a spin and share butter i know share butter is very very common but you need to get the organic one get original share butter and get your a spin if you get all those stuff you are good and then add in almond oil and it's in case you don't have this base cream that I'm using. So, if you don't have stretch marks, let me tell you how you can prevent it. Me, what I usually do, Aspin is very, very good. If you don't know much about Aspin, I suggest you Google it. Just Google Aspin, you get to know. A lot of stuff about a spin a spin helps a lot like if i eat me i cannot put mix my cream without adding in a spin in it a spin is going to help you fight against you know there are some cream solutions that when you use they'll start giving you some problems so what i usually do is for my safety i all i do is i'll just smash some of my a spin like you like I said, I earlier said, I will add it into my pomix cream to prevent those rashes, stretch marks, green veins. Aspin helps a lot in preventing green veins and stretch marks, even rashes, even skin redness, even skin sagginess. Aspin is going to help you do that. So I, I always have Aspin here at home. So guys, can you see how smooth this looks like? Like it's very, very smooth. I love it. I can't wait to use it. 
so what you need to do is just take this put it wherever you have stretch marks on your skin like do this every day every day if you want to see results don't worry do it like stay constant be patient don't expect the miracle to just happen like that but regular use of this product right here you are going to notice a huge difference like you see a lot a lot of stuff can you see this see see how smooth it looks and it also smells good the base come in hm. i love the smell like you can see apply your cream on your skin after applying your cream on your pomace cream on your skin then later you take this this one this stretch marks treatment apply it where you have the stretch marks that is how i use it so if you enjoyed this video make sure you give this video a thumbs up subscribe to this channel for more videos let me know in the comment section if you try this and if if it works if it works on you i'll be very very happy and if you want to see more of such videos just leave me a comment subscribe subscribe and share this video if you find this video interesting share the video share so i'll see you in my next video take care bye i love you all so much so look for a clean cup and put this inside oh my god can you see how smooth this looks like hmm. put this this will not get bad so don't even don't be afraid can you see how smooth it looks like bye bye i'll see you in my next video